Hello everyone, peace of the Lord with everybody. Today I will show you how nice is the Prophet of Islam and he was how he was encouraging his men to go and fight for him. This is Surah 9, verse number 49, and this is a translation of Muslims which I don't approve at all. But as long as this is their translation, we have to live with it. And then we will translate in Arabic from Arabic to English what is in the explanation because in there it's not in English uh, didn't have translation in this uh, website for tafsir as I know anyway one person he came to the Prophet he said you are telling me to go and attack the people the European so I can get the blondie girls are you seducing me? I don't want to go to hell. So the guy is a good guy, but the prophet, he is the filthy. Look what he said to him. Among them is many, a man who says, Grant me exemption and draw me not into trial. What the trial is? The trial he told them go and attack with me and you will get a lot of blondie girls the guy he said I'm so weak in front of women and you know you are you are seducing me to do sin this is a trial what Muhammad he said to him have they not fallen into trial already <laughs> so what and indeed hell surrounded the unbelievers in all sides but this guy is a believer and he is saying I don't want to go in a trial don't seduce me for sin now to, to, to show you what this verse means exactly I will go to the explanation and we will see what the explanation is saying you go to the page, you know, and you click at Tafsir, you will see many. I use Ibn Kathir, Al Jalalain, Al Tabari, Al Qurtubi. Any of them, they are saying the same. I choose this one, Al Tabari. Let us see what Al Tabari is saying. This is the Prophet of Islam saying the following Attack the city of Tabuk so you can enslave or win the women of the blondies so a man he said you allowed us and are you seducing us by women you know guys what kind of a prophet the prophet he says let us attack the Europeans so we can take their women the blondies Look how filthy he is. Let us attack the American so we can get all their blondie girls. That's what he's saying simply. Let us attack the French so we can get the blondie girls. Let us attack the English. Let us attack whoever is a blondie. So he is encouraging those filthy men to go and attack other nations not because of religion. As he claimed, he is seducing them as you see. by sex and by women let us go and get the blondie girls I went to Google translation I post the text as it is from there this is Arabic to English you click translate and you get the translation the translation is coming not always you know clear but it's enough I think to show you as well Tabuk which means the attack of Tabuk when he attacked Tabuk Attack the book, you will win. Tagnamu, it's, it's not translating the word because maybe the, the software don't have an equal word. Tagnamu means you will win. The girls of women yellow, Roman. You see, the blondie is coming this way in here. So attack them and you will get the blondie girls. Say it seriously. Are you giving us? Are you seducing us to fail in women? 
to go to war just for women so even some of the men they were wondering what kind of a prophet this guy is and here we go if you want to see how you can get that as we said you go to Surah 9 verse 49 the Arabic page you go to Tafsir number 3 first one it says choose Tafsir which means nothing we just telling you what to do number one is Ibn Kathir number two is a Jalalain number three is a Tabari you click in it and this page will open then you go <coughs> you count from the frame of the picture in here you see the, the yellow picture this line one line two line three line and you copy whatever it is in the front in, in the fourth line all the way to the end and some of the other side like this so you count one two three and you copy the four line this where it says the prophet saying go and attack the blondie attack the city of Tabuk so you can get the blondie girls and the women of the Roman so this is very clear evidence what kind of prophet we are talking about he is not telling them so you can uh, do victory for Allah so he is trying all kind of seduction all kind of filth to convince people to go and fight for him by sex by money by anything you want to blow on the girls so let us go and attack, attack the Roman so what that is proven to me it's very clear this is proven to me that Muhammad is a mafia guy is a satanic man like imagine I go to you and I say I am a prophet let us go and attack the American so we can get their blondie girls what, what do you think about me when I say that how come Muslims accept their prophet to say this and they say this is good imagine Muslims that this is happening to you someone he claimed to be a prophet let us say he's from India and he say to his people let us go and attack the Muslims so we can get the Arabian sexy women is that will be fine for you is that will be a proof that he's a prophet of God for you is that a proof that he's a good guy so think about it this is a very short video this is showing how filthy is this man he cannot be a prophet of God because I am not going to fight for anyone to get women to enslave women and they are blondie he I want to attack the Roman not because they attacked him because they have a blondie women this is a mentally sick person about sex about money about power I think Hitler is a lot better than him because Hitler he never attacked nations for women this person is very low very low Hitler he used to have one woman this woman he want to enslave everybody to have them for sex in his bed and his men he is seducing them to do that by sex we will spread Islam sex by what by ordering my men telling them promising them if you go and do that you will win a lot of a blondie women evil is evil and bad is bad and good is good and I challenge any Muslim to tell me give me one ex you know one excuse for a prophet of God to say go and attack that nation so we can win their women the blondie women what a shameful religion Jesus is Lord, Islam is false, Amin. Thank you.